Okay, so um, what we want to do now is export our video. So once we're done editing, we want to go up here to this button number three that says Make Movie. And this is where we're going to uh, make the movie file that will appear on YouTube or on a DVD or whatever you decide to create. So what I'm going to show you first, this interface, um, you have four different options here to export. The one that you probably would think you want is right here, and this one is called Web and you'll see in this dialog box that you can export to YouTube and Yahoo Video. The problem that I've had with this is that it only exports in a 640 by 360 resolution which is pretty low quality. I've gone ahead and done something different and I'll show you what that is. So the way you need to do it is to go up here and hit the file button and this is going to allow you to export the video as a standard uh, video file to your computer. A um, couple advantages of this. The first is that you can export in true HD video if that's what you brought into the program. Um, and you can see the resolution is 1920 by 1080 here. So um, you can see that you'll have a really good quality video on your computer that you can always go back to. Um, and not have it uploaded to YouTube and never be able to find it again. So um, that is one huge advantage. Okay, so the next advantage to um, saving a file directly to your computer is that you have it on your computer. Um, and then you can upload another copy of it to YouTube, but you always keep the original. So um, that's a good place to, you know, a good thing to keep with your source files and everything um, that you've put together so far including the project file from from this program too so that it's all in one place and you don't have to go back and find it or recreate it or do anything like that so um, anyway so the way we want to proceed from here is to make sure our settings are correct and you can see you can export in a whole bunch of different formats the one that I use is the MPEG-4 uh, version that one will um, uh, be pretty universal and it will also upload pretty good to YouTube and give you a nice HD quality video there. Um, you can see that it's uh, exporting in 1080p which is true HD. Um, you can go to smaller sizes as well but YouTube is going to automatically reformat that for you once you upload it so we want to keep it in the most uh, high definition format that we can for our own personal um, archives and so forth. So that's where we want to keep that and then the next thing we want to do is, uh, well, let's take a look under these dialog boxes. I'll show you what they are. Um, basically, this is the file. This is the file um, name that we're going to export. Okay, so I already exported this once, um, but I need to go back and fix some things that I didn't get taken care of. So I'm going to go ahead and name it Oasis2, since it's the second one that I'm exporting, and hit save. One, once I do that, it's going to start to render out this uh, movie and it's going to take all these transitions down here and uh, all of the effects and intros and all of those things and put them all together into one giant file. This can take a very long time, you know, and so this is the time to probably stand up and go get a cup of coffee or uh, Coke or whatever you prefer and um, just take a little break. Okay, so our video has finished rendering now, and it took about 20 minutes to get this video done. So it's about uh, 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 one minute for every eight minutes of rendering time is, is somewhere in the ballpark of where it works out, but um, something that is uh, necessary, and that's why you want to make sure that um, you have your video right and preview it prior to exporting it out to a file like this because um, if you forget something or leave something out like I did just uh, a little bit ago um, you have to completely re-render the entire movie and you know luckily this one's only two minutes and 40 minutes 40 seconds long but you know with YouTube you can uh, upload video up to 10 minutes long which could be you know an hour or two of, of rendering time so uh, just keep in mind to preview your videos prior to um, exporting them